tragedy has struck the South Australian football community after the passing of Antonio Loyacono, a 20-year-old Birdwood footballer who suffered critical injuries in a collision during a Hills Football League A-grade match against Gumaraka last weekend. Despite being flown to the Royal Adelaide Hospital for treatment, Loyacono tragically passed away on Sunday afternoon, leaving the entire league reeling from the loss of such a talented and beloved player. Loyacono's brother Jack paid tribute to him as, the most respectful, caring, loving and beautiful soul, adding that, he would always put a smile on everyone's face. As a new addition to the Birdwood Football and Netball Club, Antonio had already made a lasting impact on his teammates, with the club expressing their condolences to his family and remembering him as a leader who cared deeply for those around him. The Hills Football League president Joanne Purdy also shared her condolences, saying that the league was feeling immense shock, sorrow and heartache at the loss of Loyacono. SANFL Chief Executive Officer Darren Chandler echoed these sentiments, stating that Loyacono's death had shocked and saddened the entire South Australian football community. As news of Antonio's passing spread, the Great Southern Football League posted its condolences on social media, reminding everyone that, community football is what we live for. While accidents can happen in contact sport, Loyacono's untimely passing serves as a stark reminder of the risks that players face each time they step onto the field. For now, the state's thoughts and prayers are with Antonio's family, friends, teammates and everyone affected by this tragic loss.